New at 11, one Gwinnett County community says that they won't let hateful graffiti break their spirit. Gwinnett school officials discovered racist, homophobic, and political messages spray painted on the Collins Hill High School campus yesterday. Fox House Claire Sims is live at the school, and Claire, people there want to drown out those negative messages with a message of their own. Yeah, Tom, dozens of people met up right here in front of the Collins Hill High School sign last night to pose for a picture and celebrate their community's diversity. A message they say to whoever left that graffiti that love conquers hate. These are the images the Collins Hill community wants you to see. Students of all colors and backgrounds standing together. Their answer to whoever's responsible for leaving divisive messages all over the campus Tuesday morning. Racial slurs, even swastikas spray painted on signs and mobile classrooms. Honestly, the most, I was kind of disappointed because, you know, we're in 2016 and I didn't think we'd have to go through this anymore. And so, I thought it was just like ridiculous and just kind of disgusting to see that. It is our school and I take pride in going to this school. I love this school and the fact that someone would go and trash it like they did just, it hurts me. The community quickly decided to turn their disgust to action. Mom Elisa Smith McMahon invited as many people as she could to make signs and pose for pictures in front of the school. Photos that showcase unity in the face of hate. I feel like the positive messages and the diversity and all of that is really the, the true power behind the community. Community, and that's really what everybody here believes. Maintenance crews painted over the graffiti Tuesday morning, but students here hope that their message of togetherness will continue on. I hope that people see that like we are like one school, we're all just one people, and that that just doesn't even affect us, and we can still all come together and race and everything all like that. It doesn't matter with us, with our school. Gwinnett County school officials say they are reviewing surveillance footage to see if they can identify the individuals responsible, and they do plan to press charges if they are able to ID the people behind that graffiti. Now, as far as the people I talked to tonight, they say they're planning an even bigger unity event for some time next week or the week after. Reporting live in Swanee, Claire Sims, Fox 5 News.